This is going to get much worse before it gets better. I'm more worried about the equipment because many of these acute cases are going to need ventilators. And we need about 30,000 ventilators, and we can just not get them. Leaders like New York Governor Andrew Cuomo are concerned. They say our health care system is overwhelmed. There's not enough supplies to treat patients and protect health care workers. And now some are getting creative looking for solutions, like 3D printers. We have been trying to come up with an, a way of extending the limited supply of masks that we have. Suppliers are not able to get us the masks, and we have a, only a limited number on hand, so we've been trying to figure out how can we make those masks go further. In Billings, Montana, a surgeon teamed up with a dentist and a local filter company to figure out a way to create 3D-printed reusable masks. Made from a standard surgical mask, insert it into the mask, and plug the hole, thereby allowing for a filtration cartridge using only a portion of each mask. They've gotten help from local businesses and schools who have 3D printers, but what about the person sitting at home with a 3D printer, isolated from others because of the coronavirus shutdown? Is there a way they can help in this crisis? Jacob Cruzy has been 3D printing as a hobby for five years. Now that he's home 24-7, he sees his extra time as an opportunity to help, an opportunity he found online. The open source ventilator project on Facebook, there are a lot of people on that group that will have other individual projects that maybe your printer is not a high enough volume printer. You can make smaller things in high volume then. So that's one way you can help out. With the 3D printer, what's neat is that I can make a lot of really small parts rapidly, and that's what you need in a hospital situation. Like The other part of 3D printing that makes it feasible for individuals to help is the cost. When you begin to create products, you're talking cents on the dollar. A low cost with a potentially big impact. 3D printing, perhaps a good fit in our new world of social isolation. Reporting for Newsy, I'm Vinnie Politan.